If you've ever stood in your kitchen staring at a carton of eggs and wondered, how many of these can I safely eat every single day? Trust me, you are not alone. People argue about this constantly. Some say one egg, some say two, some say avoid them completely. And then you meet people eating four, six, even 10 eggs a day and feeling better than ever. So what's going on here? Why is one of the simplest foods on the planet surrounded by so much fear, confusion, and outdated advice? Here's the truth. For decades, almost everything people were told about eggs was flat out wrong. Today, we're cutting through every myth, every headline, and every piece of bad science. So you can finally get a clear, medically accurate answer to the question everyone is afraid to answer. How many eggs can you actually eat safely per day? And before we dive in, if you care about real science, real nutrition, and real results for your body, hit that subscribe button right now because on this channel, I give you the information most people will never hear from mainstream health advice. And I promise you this, if you stay with me until the end, the truth about eggs is going to shock you, and it might even change the way you eat for the rest of your life. One, why we're all confused about eggs. Let me start with something every doctor knows, but very few explain. Egg advice is confusing because most studies from the 60s, 70s, and 80s were deeply flawed. They didn't separate eggs from bacon, eggs from pancakes, eggs from processed oils. They simply labeled the entire breakfast as an egg meal. No wonder eggs were blamed. They were guilty by association. Today's research is completely different, more precise, more controlled, and far more accurate. And the conclusion is becoming clearer and clearer. Eggs are one of the most nutrient-dense, metabolically supportive foods on the planet. And for most people, daily consumption is not only safe, it may actually be beneficial. But before we answer how many, we need to fix one more problem. Let's address the egg aisle deception. Walk into a grocery store and you'll see a wall of labels. Cage-free, free-range, vegetarian-fed, natural, omega-3, organic. Most people assume these labels reflect quality. But here's the truth. Most of them are marketing. Cage-free just means the hens aren't in cages. They can still be packed tightly inside a barn. Free range sounds amazing until you learn the legal requirement is simply access to the outdoors, even if the outdoor area is a tiny concrete patch. Vegetarian fed. This one surprises most people. Chickens are not vegetarians. They need bugs, insects, worms, larvae, not soy and corn. Natural. There is no scientific definition for a natural egg. So what should you look for? Pasture raised plus organic, this is the gold standard. These hens roam on grass, eat their natural diet, and produce eggs with higher vitamin A, higher vitamin E, higher omega 3s, higher zinc and selenium, higher choline, higher lutein and zeaxanthin, natural vitamin K2. A pasture raised egg is almost a different food entirely. 3. What makes eggs a nutritional powerhouse? A single egg contains high-quality complete protein, healthy fats, brain-up supporting choline, eye-protecting antioxidants, fats-soluble vitamins A, D, E, K, 2B vitamins for metabolism, minerals for immunity, and hormone balance. And here's the biggest secret. The nutrients in eggs are incredibly bioavailable. That means your body absorbs and uses them much more efficiently compared to most foods. Eggs are also one of the richest natural sources of choline, a nutrient essential for memory, focus, mood, liver health, nervous system communication. Most people are choline deficient. Eggs fix that. The only vitamin eggs don't provide is vitamin C, which is why pairing eggs with veggies is perfect. 4. The Great Cholesterol Lie Let's address the elephant in the room, cholesterol. For decades, eggs were labeled dangerous because they contain dietary cholesterol, but modern science has flipped this upside down. What we know now, your liver makes about 3,000 migors of cholesterol every day. When you eat cholesterol, your liver simply produces less. When you eat less, your liver produces more. This feedback loop keeps your levels stable. But here's the biggest shocker. Dietary cholesterol does not significantly raise blood cholesterol in most people. What does raise LDL? Sugar refined carbs, inflammation, oxidized oils, and chronic stress. Eggs were never the problem. Cholesterol is not a villain. It's a repair molecule. Your body uses it to build every cell membrane, make vitamin D, produce hormones, create bile acids for digestion, repair tissue damage. So blaming cholesterol for artery damage is like blaming firefighters for fire. 
So how many eggs can you safely eat per day? That's the real question, isn't it? After everything we've just covered, you want the clear line, the definitive answer. And while I stand by as many as you want in the right context, let's get tactical because your individual health is the most important context of all. The landmark research for most healthy people, studies consistently show up to three eggs per day is not just safe, it's often beneficial. And in the context of a low sugar whole foods diet, those numbers can go much higher. Let me break it down person by person. For the general healthy adult, two to three eggs daily is your sweet spot. Safe, nutritious, smart. Pushing to four, you're likely boosting your intake of those critical fat-soluble vitamins and antioxidants we talked about. Athletes and highly active individuals, your body is a rebuilding machine. Three to six eggs per day can be a perfect bioavailable protein source to support that repair and muscle synthesis. Listen to your body's hunger signals here. People with normal LDL and low inflammation, the metabolically healthy. This is key. If your blood work is solid and inflammation is low, three to six eggs daily can be a powerhouse tool. They enhance satiety, support stable energy, and can be a fantastic ally in body composition goals. Older adults, sarcopenia, age-related muscle loss, is a real threat. Eggs provide the highest quality protein to fight it. Two to three eggs per day is a highly recommended, easy-to-digest strategy for muscle retention and overall nutrition. People with type 2 diabetes or insulin resistance. Eggs have virtually zero carbs. They do not raise your blood sugar. They are a stabilizing force. Two per day is a great start. Three is perfectly safe if your diet is consistently low in refined carbs and sugars. They help you feel full without the spike. People with high cholesterol, the most asked about group. This is where we apply the real science. For most, one to two eggs per day shows no increased heart risk. But the critical action isn't cutting eggs. It's cutting sugar and processed foods that cause the arterial damage cholesterol tries to repair. Attack the fire, not the firefighter. Children, growing bodies need dense nutrition. One egg per day is a stellar foundation. For active growing kids, more can be perfectly appropriate to meet their energy and development needs. And yes, to address the elephant in the room, there are people, especially in low-carb and keto communities, who consistently eat six, eight, even ten eggs a day, and they thrive. Their secret, their diet, has eliminated the real drivers of disease sugar, seed oils, and processed junk. But there are exceptions. This isn't a blanket prescription. If you have a specific rare genetic disorder like familial hypercholesterolemia, your body doesn't regulate cholesterol normally, you need a personalized plan from your doctor. If you have a confirmed egg allergy, obviously this doesn't apply, and this is crucial. The benefits assume you're eating quality eggs, pasture-raised and organic, and a diet that supports metabolic health. 10 eggs with a side of fries and a soda is a completely different story. So find your group. Start with the baseline. And remember, the egg isn't the problem. It's the solution we've been cracking open to find all along. 6. Who should be cautious? Eggs are incredibly safe, but caution is needed for 1. Egg allergies, obvious but important. 2. Severe lipid genetic disorders such as familial hypercholesterolemia, very rare. 3 gallbladder removal, or fat digestion issues. Start with one egg per day and build up slowly. Four, people sensitive to histamines, cook eggs fresh. Avoid reheating. If you fall into these categories, talk to your health care provider before going above two per day. Seven, the healthiest ways to eat eggs. The way you cook eggs drastically changes their health impact. Best methods. One, soft-boiled. Two, hard-boiled. Three, poached. Four, over easy. 5. Scrambled on low heat. 6. Cooked in butter or olive oil. Low heat. Avoid. 1. Very high heat. 2. Browned crispy eggs. 3. Cooking in vegetable oils. 4. Burning or overcooking yolks. Why? High heat damages fats and oxidizes cholesterol, turning a perfect food into a less healthy one. The healthiest yolk is soft and golden, not gray or crumbly. 8. Simple daily egg plan. Here's how to use eggs based on your goal. For weight loss, 2 to 3 eggs with veggies keeps you full and stabilizes insulin. For muscle growth, 3 to 5 eggs plus high quality carbs or potatoes. Perfect amino acid balance. For energy focus, 
two to three eggs plus avocado boosts choline and healthy fats. For seniors, one to two eggs plus greens supports muscle retention and brain health. For busy mornings, two boiled eggs plus fruit. Simple, stable energy. Now that you know how many eggs you can safely eat per day, the next question is this. What actually happens inside your body when you eat eggs every single day? You're about to discover benefits most people have never heard of, including the ones that affect your brain, your metabolism, and even your hormone balance. Click the video on your screen now. What happens when you eat four eggs every day? It connects perfectly with what we covered today, and I'll walk you through the exact transformations that happen inside your body step by step. I'll see you there.